Hey girls, before this video starts, I just wanted to say that I'm also part of Facebook Gaming, so I'll be putting out exclusive videos over on my Facebook page. Follow me over there if you want to see actual gameplay that you will not get anywhere else. I also just wanted to say that I have a merch store and my newest design is this pixelated teddy bear design that you can get over at my merch store with the link in the description box below. Enjoy the video! Okay, we are going first strike Karthus. Um, we are gonna try get Axiom Arc. I don't know if this will... Um, well, actually, I know this won't be good because I've already tried it once. Um, because last time I tried it, I had like 100 gold per ult. Oh. No. But going to try. So I got like 100 ish gold each time I ulted the last time I played Karthus. Um, apparently, Peck and Wolf had, did it and he got like 250 gold per cast. The difference is that he plays mid lane. So he has more damage, like more money in mid lane, more damage. So he gets more gold from his first strike because the more damage you do, the more gold you get. For me, I am in support, obviously, so I don't have that same luxury. So I don't think I would have the same level of success as like Peck and Wolf or whatever. Whoever's doing like Axiom Arc, Karthus, blah, blah, first strike. But, you know, let's give it a shot. Um, we got some gold there. We got 40 gold plus 17, 40 from Frostfang. Um, so... We'll do Leandre into Axiom Arc. So I'm actually kind of wanting to do Axiom Arc first. Me watching Kaya Foundation because I can see someone playing Seraphim and I'm not hating on her. Yes, I will hate on Seraphim. What is that skin? Hello. Snowstorm, but with a ugly chroma. That's so ugly. Do you guys want to see Axiom go like Axiom Arc first or Leon Jews? What did Peckham do? I would assume if you went Axiom Arc, you would do no damage and you'd be trolling. <laughs> so, probably Leon Jews first. But like the ultimate, I want to ult people, that's so fun. I'm getting some pretty decent poke off. We just have to auto attack her. Oh. So I didn't want to cue the Samira because if I cue, she can always fl flash it. But if I auto attack her, she'll be forced to eventually flash. Oh, I'm already revived. I caught this passive. Um, I'm not used to that. Um, you'll be. She'll be forced to flash. She did it, so she ended up dying just to auto attacks. Uh, with the Twitch. I wanted to queue like where he would flash because he would die if he didn't flash. So I didn't have to queue on top of him. I just had to queue where he will go. Um, because if I queue on top of him, he'll just flash and then like it's he escapes. Why don't Luden give more Leandre? Um, Leandre spreads five people. Luden's only hits one one person. They're unlikely to be standing next to each other for the Luden's to hit three people if you're just ulting randomly. Like, Luden does a splash damage on 2-3 people at, in total, but they're not going to be standing next to each other for that to even happen. So... I'm gonna Twitch. Hello? Okay, Twitch. Oh, Oh, we're getting some good pike. It will hit all five people. Um... Oh, Night Harvester. Um, I was thinking, uh, someone did point out Night Harvester, but I mean, I don't want to be useless outside of my ult, you know? Like, it should be okay. Boom! Oh, love that! Double kill. Double kill. Uh, do I want to wait in base for this? We'll just wait for in base for this. Maybe Seraphim was a still a trainee during the first. Um, I'll be upset if they put in Seraphim and not Janna. Like, I'll be upset. 
Like, if they put in Seraphin in, into Arcane before we actually see Janna or whatever, like, I just know Riot doesn't care about Janna. Like, Janna needs buffs. She hasn't had a buff since, like, Season 9 or something like that. She's been useless. Everyone complains about how useless she is, and I agree. I like Janna. I love Janna. I'm a Janna main, obviously, but I can see that she needs a buff. She's so weak. Um, and, you know, Riot just wants to sell skins on Janna, but they don't want to give her any buffs, and they don't want to give her any Arcane, like, spotlight, like, bitch plays, like... Hello? Like, why would they do that? Oh my god, bitch! My god! You're a man, bro, and what about it? Your dad sucks my dick every single day and he pays for it. So what about it, Granny, Granny Ghost? What about it? Your dad's in my DMs. He wants me. he wants to see me. He wants to suck me off, so what's the problem, officer? Oh. Please come. Um, I was reading Twitch chat. And also we were pushed in, so we can't come. Alright. Don't be a woman, they don't have rights. Um, you know, guys like chicks and guys like dicks, and I'm a chick with a dick, so what is the problem, yeah. officer? <laughs> Where's the problem? True, right? So true. Hi, Philip. How are you? I want to get my ultimate. I want my first strike goldery. Oh, true, right? Oh, it's Jordan. Oh, the dash, hello. You better get away from me, Twitch. Oh, he's programming. Just so you know, Twitch, the money's better on me. So, if you guys have probably... Okay, you know, that's good. Thank you. Um, you guys have probably seen me talk about this channel tons and tons of times. It's Happy Chime Noises. Go watch him. He, he makes a lot of videos on, like, different one tricks or whatever. And Karthus... If you watch his, the Karthus video, I think it was, like, Karthus support or something. Grandmaster Karthus support or something. Anyways... Or was ADC? I don't know. Either way, the money is better on Karthus. Because Karthus scales so well, like 300 gold on Karthus is more useful than 300 gold on like Samira. Why? Because Karthus can like... Karthus is just a strong character, like late game, with its items. Like he can get more mileage out of that money. So it's totally fine for you to go like one for one trades. In fact, that's kind of what you want because you want the money. So it's definitely fine that like Karthus can like you know, die for the money. Oh, bitch. Fuck. Oh my god, I think these trolls are jealous that their dads get the action. Anyway. Oh my god, that was skinny on me. Hello. Oh my god, bitch. Bitch, what do they want from me? Hello? I don't think my ult will kill him, so yeah, 281, he had 270, 270 health and he had magic resistance, so I wouldn't have killed the, the Twitch. Wait, could this kill with Leandre's? Oh, did he go back already? Fuck. Oh, I, I should have waited for my first strike, god. I didn't get money. Fuck, I wasted it. Okay, let's go for Axe Team Arc. Actually, you know what? Let me get... Sork Boots and then Axiom Arc. I was thinking of Lucidity, but Lucidity will make the Axiom Arc do less because your cooldowns are less and then the 20, 25% is less. And Sork Boots will let me do more damage for me to get the kills and all. That's pretty skinny of me, hello. 
I will kill them. How fucking dare they? Get the CS, get the CS, get the CS, get the CS. I miss the CS. <laughs> How did Caitlyn game go? Pretty horribly. I actually just want to run in over and over again. Like, honestly, I kind of just want to keep going in and keep getting trades off. Like, as the faster I get Axiom Arc, the better, right? Surely. So, you know what? This is working out better than the Caitlyn support, this. And it's working out better than the last time I played card to support, but that could just be because of like matchup or something. Last time I played card to support, it was like, I think I was getting destroyed, I can't remember. And I wasn't doing a lot. Oh, not the, not the rated bot moment. Hold on. Um, do I have a mod in here to change it to follower mode only? Not the bot rated bot marmont. Um, let me do this. Enemy rampage. Thank you. Gotta get caught this sick, yes please. <laughs> what is it? I know the bot raidery, hello. I think they're doing something. Shut down. Oh, not me missing. Not me missing. Oh, if I just land a Q on her, she'd be dead with my ult. Oh, it's warded here. Well, hello. Oh, she'd be dead. I wanna get her. Oh, not me taking that. She might dive to me. They're coming down, but I, I don't mind. I, I want money. I wanna kill them. Twitch may come for me. Better on me. Oh, I walked into that. Oh my god. Not skinny. <laughs> Fuck you. I will get you a bunch. Okay, Axiom Arc. Axiom Arc, let's go. Oh. If I revive and he does enough damage. Not enough damage. We will raid by Lux Mains, honestly. Wait, what that? What is this build? Uh, the Axiom Arc reduces the cooldown of your ult. I mean, I don't think it would work on support. Like, this is for- I want to make this clear. This is a for fun build, okay? This is not- Oh my god, it's hard to support new meta? Like, I think at this point, your girl, you girls should be quite aware that I, like, kind of play whatever for fun. And, like, I play whatever- um, you know, just because I'm like, curious, like, for my own entertainment. Like, when it's serious, I will let you know, like, when it's, like, actually a serious build, like... And you'll probably tell that when it's a serious build, it, when I'm playing ranked and, like, lots of... Showing lots of ranked games and, like, climbing a lot with it. Like, my Mouser Heart is a for fun build, like, and yes, I'm kind of climbing with it. I think it's okay. Out of like all the for fun builds, it's on the like okay to good side. Like there is some potential. <laughs> I am. Um, something like the um, what other builder have I been doing? I don't know. Like first strike Zyra. That is gonna be just like a more for fun thing. GG. I don't, what the? Wait. Why didn't he ping for me? <laughs> Bye, rat! Goodbye! Yes, my kill! 
<laughs> Wait, the money. The money. I have Axiom Ark now. I have Axiom Ark. The money. Why, I'm so ready. 436 gold. I am ready. Me thinking I could be killing main after. Honestly, the marketing is insane with Arcane. Not just Arcane, but Riot. Like, Riot did KDA. And KDA um, really got a lot of the girlies into League. I absolutely know that for sure. Like, I've, I've seen so many people being like, I've never seen League of Legends. I've never played League of Legends, but I am now playing it because, you know, I saw Seraphine KDA or whatever. And then, like, now we have, like, this influx of Seraphine maids or, like, Ari maids or whatever. Um, and now with Arcane, like, definitely a lot of people have gotten to, into Arcane because... Sorry, got into League because of Arcane, because, like, they never touch League or blah blah blah, and it's like... You know, I've seen, like, in my chat some people saying, like, Oh my god, like, my dad watched Arcane or blah blah blah. The call-out? Well, it's not really a call-out, like... Like, if you go into, if you go into League through Seraphim, like, sure, like, I'm not saying anything bad about it. If you think it's a call-out, like, I think it's more like you're trying to see something bad in what I say, what I said, like, there's nothing bad with that. Um, bitch, just leave. I, I hate people like this, Camille. Like, I honestly, I would rather them leave if they want to complain. Like, bitch, go play Hello Kitty. Like, literally go play Hello Kitty. Oh, fuck off. Nah. I need more money. It's like, it's just, no it's normal and they're feeding and like, they want to complain and like surrender and go next. Like, honestly, just leave. Like, I'm having fun on my carpet still. You know, I'm getting my money. Okay, what do we want to go next? Um... I don't think Cosmic Drive, because like, if you have Axiom Arc, you just kind of want to do as much damage, you don't want to... You don't want to get lots of cooldown to just like, ult people, because the more cooldown you get, the less you'll get out of Axiom Arc. Like, let's just say, if your, your ultimate is 100 cooldown, and then 25% of that you get from Axiom Arc is 25 seconds. If your ultimate was down to 50 seconds, you would only get 25% 25, 25 of that would only be 12.5 seconds instead. So like you get less out of Axiom Arc the more cooldown you have. Shadow Flame is busted. Uh, I do think yeah, I do think Shadow Flame is good, but I'm not what cut this. Oh fuck. <laughs> that me. You know, you probably would want to go ADC Carthus or mid lane Carthus if anything. And support. <laughs> Let me just... I can't ult just yet, because... <laughs> Love that for me. Love the burn damage on me. Summons here. Wait, my ultimate cooldown! Hello, it's already 36. What? Oh my god, my ult's back up! <gasps> I'm so... Oh my god, I love this. I, by the way, I knew the I knew the thing was um the, the mushroom was in there, but there was no way I was gonna live because Kiana was coming. But wait, I'm like kinda here for Axiom Arc. Wait a damn minute. Thank you for the time questions. At first, I was a bit like this can't possibly be like that good. But. Congrats on the 100k subscriber. Thank you so Keep much, the awesome stream, MM. Thank you, thank you. Louis Bertin Carthus. Well, to be fair, this is not like my build or anything. Like, other people have done this already. I heard it from Peckinwolf. Or should I say, I heard it from my chat who heard it from Peckinwolf. Oh, I should have ulted. Get me the kill, get me the assist. Maybe I should just run in and ult him. Uh oh. Oh no, I'm not getting an assist on Nidale. Wait, it's already 56. Hello? I'm kind of here for this. I assume Ark is cancer, Bessie. Oh. 
Oh, oh, oh my god, I'm so bad. Oh, <laughs> I'm kind of bad. My scripts are off. How did not frog this the unlucky timing by me? Axiom arc on Z is cancer. Ah, oh, axiom arc on Z. Uh, I'm just thinking like, isn't Z's ultimate so quick anyways? I swear to God, it's like 20 seconds already, like late game to the point like, does it really matter? Because like I said, with the like the more cooldown you have, the less you get. Like if it's already 20 seconds and then you like axiom arc and then you would just buy point five. That's like four seconds. Like what does four seconds mean? You know. I mean, I don't actually know if it's 20 seconds, but you get the point, right? So I don't know. Also, is this Camille okay? She's kind of like farming, like she should play Maple Story. Oh, I wanted to ult, but then Mordecai's ulted, so I don't get anything out of that. Is that as a jungler now? Oh, so true, I love that. <laughs> Oh, someone's here. Oh, she's gonna done yes. Oh, no, mind you not. Maybe she didn't have it. <gasps> 56 seconds already? That's actually so disgusting. That's so disgusting. And I got. Wait, did that. Wait. Did I not get an assist? Didn't I get an assist on Kiana? How come I didn't? Didn't I get an assist or... Oh, it's within 3 seconds, so true. So true. I mean... Axiom Arc Brand. Cause damage over time... Like if you damage over time, people like you just like can get the assists off maybe. <laughs> I don't know, maybe Axiom Arc brand. You know what? I kinda wanna try that. We'll put that on the list eventually. I got my ult ready, so y'all should get some kills for me, thank you. Let me just run up to them and like fight. <laughs> I love this. Hello. I I am so in love with this Axiom Arc. This would definitely be much more better on a mid lane or jungle card this or ADC card this or top lane card this. Like as a support, you're definitely like always gonna be working from behind in terms of like in comparison. Like I just have less money than a mid laner. I just have less money than an AC. So my snowballing potential, whatever, is gonna be less. So this is still at the end of the day like a for fun thing. So. Um, just want to make it clear if anyone's wondering like, oh my god, I want to decart this. Um, support, stick to normals, unless you really want to pull, pull it out in ranked. Um, I guess Shadow Flame. I mean, they only have one person that shield, actually. With that. Immortal Shield Bow. I could get Sonya's. Or Demonic Embrace for more damage. Axiom Lulu. Um, I don't think Lulu. Oh, they're probably gonna fight, maybe. Not the team I'm trying to be invisible. I. Oh. Oh. Well. I see why Axiom Arc Ash is like so good. All that flashing and for what, huh? And like, you actually, like by the time I revive, like, it's, for, it's 50 seconds, but by the time I revive, I will have my ultimate back up. So you don't necessarily need to, like, get 100%. Like, you don't need to kill, like, three people and then get banned. Like, oh my god, instant refresh. Or close to instant refresh. Like, you'll just revive anyways. And get that cooldown back. So that's something to think about. Like, you really only need to kill one person if you really want that 100% uptime on it. 
You probably want to sell it eventually. Like, once you have like full build, you probably want to sell it eventually because, I mean, like, why why keep that? It doesn't do all the damage. Well, that crying and then for <laughs> that Camille to just win the game anyway, right? Like, just play. Like, ugh, stop being such a baby. Baby vibes. Um, uh, I mean, if I have first strike, am I meant to just ult randomly? Am I meant to just ult, like, any time? If I ult randomly and then I get assist in a fight, then I get my ult back, like, I guess that's totally fine. By the way, does anyone remember Revive Karthus, the summoner spell? Revive? That was so stupid. <laughs> like, he, he was literally the only one that would ever use Revive and no one else used it. <laughs> you know what? I want to just... Oh, because I want money. Oh, period. I, I did get 200 gold. Oh my god. I actually did get 200 gold. Plus the Nidalee thingy. I'm... Okay, now I see the 200 gold. I think the last, the first time I played card to support was because I just was too far behind three laning phase or whatever, so I like didn't get a lot. And now I have my ult again, and I'm just gonna ult the next time. I mean, when I revive. Oh, I'm so here for this. Uh, they're not getting any magic resistance. Um, also, their team comp is kind of squishy, which is good for me. Like, if they had tanks, it would be a problem. So, there is also that. Like, maybe because I'm versing this team comp that, like, Karthus excels against. Um, that's why I'm thriving. Possibly. Oh, actually, I actually have Horizon Focus, actually. So true. <laughs> Get in there. <laughs> oh my god! Hello? Oh my god, I'm so here for this! Like, you know what? I'm so here for this. I kind of like this. Um, I guess we'll just buy a elixir of sorcery and yeah. An ally has been slain. Let me wait for them to revive, and I'm just gonna ult back. <laughs> I'm gonna ult for money. I have so much gold from this. Hello, I love that. I kind of do a lot of damage to this. Oh, Nocturne with this would be so annoying, actually. Nocturne would like destroy everyone. You just like, oh, bam, oh, bam. I wonder if Gangplank would be really annoying with this. I was actually thinking that, but I was thinking I don't really play Gangplank and I don't want to play Gang. I mean, I do want to play Gangplank support, but I don't play Gangplank, so it doesn't really make any sense. Like, I wouldn't even be able to like play him properly to like do anything on him. Ah! Uh, oh my god, that damage! Oh my god, I like shit on her. I mean, she's 1 in 10, 1 in 10, 4, so I guess. <laughs> Hi, more. You guys should try this, this is so fun. But yeah, if, if I was like a Nocturne player, or if Nocturne could support, yeah, like Nocturne in general, I, could, I can definitely see Nocturne doing really well. Which means like, I, I would. I haven't tried Senna yet, but I'm, I'm pretty sure Senna would be really good. We could put Senna on the list uh, what, on, on what, what to play, but I didn't really want to do Senna because I just felt like perhaps that was like too obvious. Like, we, we probably already know that Senna works really well. But, okay. the hell you want? Oh, no. <laughs> Not that. Oh. I don't want to end this, honestly. 
Let me just sell my ward item. I'm gonna sell it for a... Probably not a Magi's because I'm dying. And maybe this. I don't think demonic. I think I mean they don't really have any magic. Oh, they this decide to get magic races. That's so many. Twenty two. Wait, that's not the right. That's not correct math, actually. Twenty five percent of seventy is not twenty two. That's not correct math, actually. Not cosmic. I already explained why not cosmic. Um, actually, I want gold, so let me just alt. <laughs> let me just alt for gold. How much gold do I get? 273! Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> money! Oh my god! Money! Carthus is so... Carthus can be a millionaire. How much did I get? Was it 273? But gold is now useless though. Not true. I, I still have yet to buy. Oh, I'm still alive. So true. That's not true. I still have I still have yet to buy the Void Star. And I need to refresh my Alexa. And the first strike is still relevant, like the 10% damage. Oh, so true. Goodbye, world. Damn. That's not correct that. Something it must be the 25%. Is that their way of making cooldown reduction fine? Like if you get cosmic? Because like I said, like if you had the more cooldown you get, the maths like with the percentages, the less you get out of Axiom. But perhaps the Axiom arc, unless it's bugged and they meant to fix it, maybe it like works before the cooldown reduction and then the cooldown reduction works on your ultimate. So maybe the 22, 22 seconds is assuming I actually have 88 seconds on my ultimate. But that wouldn't be because I, I have 44% cooldown reduction and without all this cooldown, it wouldn't be 88 seconds. So that's not true actually. So the math isn't correct. I'm pretty sure it's a bug. It doesn't make any sense. Because Karthus with no cooldown. Karthus League of Legends. Karthus League of Legends. If I can find Wikipedia. It's... Yeah, Karthus ult is 160 at level 3 with no cooldown. So even if it was 25% of that, that would be 40 seconds, not 22. So Axiom Arc is not considering before the cooldown. So... Oh, not my camera freezing, hello? Not my camera freezing. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. That's such a fun game. Um, yeah, I, I don't know about the Axiom Arc. I, I think they might change it, they might fix it. I, it's not correct. Like, even before or after the cooldown calculations, like, it shouldn't be 22 seconds. So I, I have no idea. Maybe it works before the Ultimate Hunter. Oh, could be that. That would make sense then. Ultimate Hunter at 35 or something. That probably would make sense, actually, before the Ultimate Hunter. But anyways, that's Karthus, um support with First Strike and Axiom Arc. It's kind of fun. You guys should try it out in normals. Probably not in rank, but try it out in normal. It's very fun. Oh, wait. Let's see the damage I didn't even see. Oh, <laughs> love that for me. Love that I do most damage. And this Camille that was complaining still won, you know? That was really fun. 
Love that.